what's up? Howdy, folks! So today's Fem Talks was requested by a viewer who wanted to know how to approach girls. Now, this is tricky, especially when you're fem and all the ladies that you're attracted to think you're straight. How do you approach them? First thing about approaching girls, the most important thing that you can ever, ever know and ever remember is to dun -dun -dun -dun, be confident. And if you're not confident, because I know that it is hard to remain confident all the time, believe you me, you need to fake it. Confidence really does make all the difference. You don't have to be the most confident person in real life, but if you fake it, people will be drawn to you. You're not sure of their sexuality. Like, if you do not know that if they're gay or queer or straight or whatever, and, you know, you want to approach them, when you do approach them, after you've approached them, try and somehow drop hints about your sexuality. So, whether you just went to Gay Pride, or you just went to a Tegan and Sarah concert, or you've got tickets to go to one, or maybe you're watching The L Word reruns. Whatever it is, make sure you drop some subtle hints about your own sexuality. And kind of subconsciously, she will hopefully put two and two together. One thing you don't ever want to do though, of course, is bring up an ex. So you don't want to let her know you're gay by talking about your ex-girlfriend. That is, that is never a good way to start out any potential courtship. So one of the things that you never want to do ever in a million years, because it is such a put off and it is just so ugh, ugh, are pickup lines. You know the types of pickup lines I'm talking about. I'm not drunk. I'm just intoxicated by you. If beauty were time, you'd be eternity. Are you religious? Because you're the answer to my prayers. No, 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 none of those, please. Thank you very much. You do not want to be that person. Now, if you are at a club or a bar or some place where they're serving drinks. You know, a really great way to strike up a conversation is just to ask, can I buy you a drink? It's a not too imposing way, but also gets the point across way of letting somebody know that you're interested in them. And if they say no, which they might, realize that it wasn't meant to be. And then of course, if they say yes, and they should know that. You want to talk to them further. If she ends up being straight, she'll be extra confused by it. If she's not straight, she'll know exactly why you want to buy her a drink. But just realize that it is not always the easiest thing in the world, approaching girls. And actually, you probably all know that. If you're watching this video, there's probably a reason you're watching it. And yes, approaching girls is never easy. It never becomes easy. There's nothing I can say that'll make it easy, but hopefully the few things that I talked about will help you in some way or another. Thank you so much for watching, lovelies, and sorry I've been a kind of not-so-frequent vlogger lately. I've been really busy, and it's been a crazy week, but I am back. I am back. Here I am. I love you all. Leave me a comment below if you have a way that you like approaching girls, that works, or maybe doesn't work and you know you should never do, or maybe there's been a way that somebody's approached you that you've liked or really don't like. Let me know in the comments. Give us a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you're not already. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye! gonna make a big deal out of it it was just my hair and just something that I did because I wanted to but since then I got a little bit